Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're watching a Jerry Springer show video about a mum who literally stole her daughter's boyfriend. Thank God I'm never going to be in a relationship. Please meet Misty. Misty says she's heard rumors and she wants to find out the truth. Misty, tell us about those rumors. Okay, so this is Misty. I'm assuming this is the daughter. I kind of feel bad for her because if her mum literally did steal her boyfriend, that's a massive L. Jerry, I've heard rumors that my boyfriend has slept with my mother. What? <laughs> Why would you do that? First of all, that's an L for the mum. Also, these lights are really light. Sorry about that. But that's really bad for the mother, and that's even worse for the boyfriend. I don't understand why you'd ever want to do that. So naturally, you would call the Jerry Springer show. <laughs> I mean, they're all laughing by Loki. Love it. Like, I love these videos. Also, there's a really big amount of them. I think that's quite concerning. Like, why are mothers literally sleeping with their daughter's boyfriends? Where have you heard those rumors? Um, his cousin has told me. He's told me himself. <laughs> Well, that's not a rumor. He's telling you he's sleeping with your mother? Exactly. Like, that's so awful. Why would a mother literally do that? I always watch these shows and I genuinely hope that they are fake, but I don't think they are. I genuinely think this is real. I mean, at the end of the day, like, a mother's literally doing that to her poor daughter. Could you believe he would do such a thing or she would do such a thing? I don't want to believe it, but I'm here today to ask her about it and to find out the truth. And we are going to find out the truth and I've got a feeling it is going to be true. I mean, a lot of times these daughters and mothers are literally at each other's neck. It kind of makes you realize that, like, maybe your family isn't too bad after all. That's a pretty extreme thing. Do you, you you don't have a good relationship with your mom? No. Has she ever done anything like this to you before? Mm -mm. Oh, that's so sad, isn't it? Like, obviously, she's not got the best relationship with her mother. I feel like a lot of times these issues are probably best to be sorted out behind the scenes rather than national television. How long have you been with your boyfriend? Almost two years. Two years. Okay, well, I'll let you talk to your mom. Okay, so the mom's gonna come out and she's been with the boyfriend for two years. That's not like a new relationship. Like, that's like quite long. They've been going at it for quite a while. I wonder how long the mum's been going at it as well. Oh my god, they're calling the mum a whore. Oh. 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 Oh my god, right, so she just walked out in the proper square enough. I mean, she's wearing red and that's usually a bad sign. Oh, damn, right, so apparently she's been doing it for four months. They're really going at it. I feel so bad for her. Like, I'm so happy my family's not like that. I cannot deal with that. I just run away and never come back. But the mother's been doing it for four months. Yet again, this should have been dealt behind the scenes, not natural television. What about me? How could you sleep with my boyfriend? How could I be? Yeah, very easy. Yeah. He made me feel good. He made me feel good. How could you sleep with him? He made me feel good. Oh my god, you can't say that. It doesn't matter if you feel you... Uh, I can't even say stuff like I'm actually speaking in gibberish. It doesn't matter if he made you feel good, you still done it. I'm supposed to come to you and trust you and talk to you. Trust? You never You're supposed to be the only woman around that I can come and talk to. You don't to. come to me, Missy. You're supposed to be my mother. I am your mother. You're my mother sleeping with my boyfriend. I mean, to be fair, I would not come to her as well if that were my mother. I would not go to her because she seems like a nightmare. I feel like she's definitely the type of mother to shame her daughter and, like, make her daughter feel like a really bad person. The mother's always gonna make herself out as a victim. Also, I'm pretty sure this specific clip was in, like, the early 2000s. I wonder what they're doing now. That was 20 years ago. How do you explain that? I mean, really, this is your daughter. He, she's been going with him for, what, a year, two years? Jerry, she ran around, and he came there one night. He needed comfort. Oh, yeah, so he needed comfort, so I'm gonna sleep with my daughter's boyfriend. Yeah, that's so comfortable. Yet again, this is 20 years old. I wonder what's going on. Like, does she have a baby? Does she still speak to the mother? I'm assuming the mother's like in her 40s or 50s. She could be dead now. He made me feel young. He needed comfort. He your boyfriend was in the other room. You wasn't there for me. You was not there. You don't go my boyfriend. Oh my god, wait a minute. So she said her other boyfriend was in the room. So the mother cheated on her boyfriend as well. Oh god, wow. I'm telling you, these early 2000 clips are golden. You don't go Well, she ain't a good mother by the sound of if you're doing that with your daughter's boyfriend. Yet again, thank God my family's not like that. Like, I actually am brought up in a normal family. Oh my God, now she's cutting out the audience. Oh my god, she's proper cussing out the audience as it. I mean, that's low key iconic. I feel like if I ever went to one of them shows, I would absolutely cuss out everyone. I
Wait, are they saying rug the whores? And honey, I would not want to look like you. Lord almighty. Are you worried about what this does to your relationship with your daughter? Yeah, I, I, mean, I worry about the relationship in the heart. Wait, what? You worry about the relationship in the heart? Well, then don't sleep with her boyfriend. That's one way to sort out your relationship. That's like you going up punching someone and saying, oh, I hope they forgive me. Like, no, they're not. But I need This is hurting her, know. isn't it? But aren't there other people to find other than her boyfriend? Yeah. yeah. She should. She didn't properly finish her sentence, but I swear she was gonna go and say, I need comfort too. Keep in mind, she already has a boyfriend, now she's sleeping with her daughter's boyfriend. Why don't we bring him out? Here he is. Oh, here's the boyfriend. What's he gonna look like? Is he gonna be a beauty one or stinker? Oh, a stinker. They always look like that. Like, I could just tell he was gonna be like that. He was an absolute stinker. It's always the men with the skinheads. Like, I get so many women. Oh. Oh, no, nah, I don't like the way they're speaking to each other, the girl as well. Now, nah, that's a toxic relationship. If I were the girl, I'd leave him immediately. Okay, let's look at this. The boy's literally laughing and giggling. She is furious and she's laughing. Please tell me this is fake. Like, I hope this isn't real. Look how you treat me, Misty. How? Look, how? Look and you see. I'm sorry, but if I were Misty, I would have turned around and knocked you out. Like, I'm not even kidding. I would have taken a right to Misty's doing a very good job at composing herself. I can never do it. If I were in one of these shoes, I probably would get dragged out by security. I would deck someone. Did you sleep with her? Yes, I did. Two weeks ago. Oh. Where was I? Yeah, exactly. Where was she? Where did you do it? Please don't tell me you done it in her bed. Nah, I'm sorry. What's actually going on with these families? This just screams America. I mean, it is an American show. Only this would happen in America. Well, to be fair, there is a Jeremy Kyle show. Maybe us Brits are as bad as the Americans. Two weeks ago. Where was I? Where? I don't know. I don't like where the audience is laughing at them. Like, this is like a real thing that's going on. And the audience is literally laughing at them. You feel a little bad about that? No. No? <laughs> what do you want to say to her? You always be nagging at me, Misty. You don't never trust me. Well, I mean, I don't blame her if you're literally going around with her mom. So because she was nagging and didn't trust you, you cheated on her with her mother. Nah, I'm sorry. That's actually like, I don't even know. How would you say that? That is like the bullet in the bullet hole. What? even having this desire since we've been together two years i ain't been up to nothing i can't go out with my friends no, i can't you go can't nowhere why? Yeah, exactly why why can't you because you probably do stuff i mean look i'm not for people being controlled in relationships but i mean like i don't blame her for not wanting you to go out if you're literally doing it with her mom what else are you gonna do it with a child why because you're a whoremonger mm -hmm. Exactly, you tell her, Misty, whenever he goes out, he goes and sleeps with all the girls, including your mother. I mean, I don't know how she's even saying in this relationship. If I were her, I'd dump him immediately. Okay, how old are you? If you 19. Don't... You're 19. 19. 18 in my heart. Okay, so he's 19 and she's 18 in the heart, but on the outside, the outer circumference, she looks about 60. He's 19, so he's my age. Now, I'm sorry, back in the day, like 2000s, people look so much older. Can we talk about that? I don't know how to describe it, because it's like kids nowadays, they do look older, but like, it's a different type of old. I feel like kids nowadays are a lot more sexualized and like, you know, all that stuff. But back in the day, if you get a 19 year old, they looked about 25. Like, there's no way that man's 25 or not 25, 19. Right, look at him and then look at me. He's 19 and so am I. We are the exact same age. 65! 65! 65! I actually love these audiences. Like, they actually make the videos. I mean, she does look 65. Imagine it turns out she's only, like, 42. You look good for that age. No, you okay, don't. So you're, you're pro I assume you're, quite a, you're twice as old as he is, at least. Right, I mean, I assume, because you're a mother. Yeah, well, she shook her head, so that means, yeah. I mean, imagine going for someone half your age. Okay, let's theoretically think, if she is 54, he's 19, so whenever she was 34, Five, he was born, something like that. I mean, she was born back in the 1970s, 80s, whatever. She's old. When did it start? About four months ago. How, how, what, what was the first time? How did that happen? Okay, so it happened four months ago. That's still like a long time. That's like a four month affair. And they're literally sat there admitting to it. Like, I could not do that because I actually would have punched them. I come over house one night. I think my lip was busted or something. I got in a fight yep. with somebody. I over missed it. Oh my God, so we got in a fight over Misty and then he went to their house and slept with his mom or her mom. I mean, to be fair, wouldn't be surprised me if he slept with his own mom. I went to a house and just, it just happened. It just happened, so he had a bust slip and then he busted in her. That's so romantic, isn't it? I love an American love story. I've been attracted to Joe 
two months after y'all got together. He's a very attractive young man. Oh my god, wait, so they've been dating for two years. He's 19, so she was attracted to him whenever he was 17. I know the legal age you can send in the UK 16. It still doesn't make it right that someone double his age is attractive whenever he's like 17. Honey, this shouldn't be the Jerry Springer show. It should be the Chris Hansen show. You need to see that. Do I? You need to see that. Why, are you trying to keep them together? Am no. Yeah, you said together? she needs to see that because you want her to be with him? Nah, what she wants is for them to break up so she can have them all to herself. Also, keep in mind, like, I'm all for, like, parents thinking, oh my god, my child's got a really attractive partner. I'm so happy for them. You know, they've found the jackpot. However, whenever you're attracted the way she is, it's weird. Okay, well, what's going to happen here now? Who do you want to be with? Missy going home with me. Oh, wait, so Misty's going home with you after you just admitted to sleeping with her mother for literal four months. Misty probably lives with her mum as well, so they're all gonna go home and have dinner. I would not want to be sat at that dinner table. Are you just gonna tell me you, I'm going home with you? You wanna be, yeah. are you saying that you're never gonna sleep with her mom again? Well, tell, yeah. talk to that's not true, he's saying, yeah, but we all know it's gonna happen next week. Honestly, Misty, you need to put your foot down, like, you need to stand up for yourself. I can tell that Misty's been, like, messed around a lot here. I mean, it's quite obvious. I feel bad for her. Well, t talk to your mo her mom. Tell her that. I can't do it for you. All right, Tina, this has been going on for about four months now. I'm ready to just leave it alone. Oh. Well, what's Tina gonna say? Imagine Tina jumps out and she's like, I'm pregnant. I mean, to be fair, it wouldn't surprise me. Are you gonna be with him? Don't. I, I love him. She will be. But... Ew, that's like such a weird thing to say she will be. That reminds me of that um clip of Khloe Kardashian and Tristan where she's like, oh, you're never gonna leave me because we got a child together. And then he turns around and he's like, no, you're not gonna leave me. I'm telling you, these men are weird. Just make sure nothing happens to his lip again. We'll be back. Okay, well, that's where that clip ended. Let's hope that nothing did happen to his lip. I mean, honestly, if you really want to, how about you give him a fat lip? Anyways, guys, that is the mom who stole her daughter's boyfriend. Moral of the story is if you've got an attractive partner, don't let your parents know. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're a Facebook, subscribe button. And yes, I'll see you all in my next video.